Hi, my name is Gauri and I'm a legal intern with Texas and Company. In this video, I'll be discussing Lok Adalat. So, Lok Adalat is an informal system of justice dispensation that has largely succeeded in providing the supplementary forum to litigants for determination and settlement of disputes. Originating from Gandhian principles, it has become a major helping hand to courts and is prescribed in Section 89 of the Code of Civil Procedure 1908 as well. The advent of Legal Services Authority Act 1987 further gave a statutory status to these low cadalas, promoting the constitutional mandate of Article 39A of the Constitution of India, which directs the state to organize low cadalas to secure that the operation of the legal system promotes justice on a basis of equal opportunity. These low cadalas provide threefold benefits involving speedy resolution of disputes coupled with reduced cost of litigation and avoiding further appeals, thereby making them the perfect instrument to resolve the heightened burden on judiciary for disposing cases. In 2018 alone, about 47 lakh cases were disposed of in lo national low cadalas, which included pending cases and pre-litigation cases. Therefore, their efficacy has been a linchpin in reducing excessive litigation. Lok Adalats are better known as the People's Courts. Therefore, they need to be available to people on every level of governance. The Act prescribes for several levels wherein Lok Adalats can be organized, ranging from the lowest courts to the apex court, which can take cognizance and organize Lok Adalats for effective and speedy justice. The persons residing over these Adalats include serving or retired judicial officials, as well as other persons as prescribed by the authority, conducting the Lok Adalats in the given area. That brings me to the end of this video. If you have any queries, you can post them in the comments. Thank you.